Tuesday we'll see the much anticipated opening of the new bus station, replacing this one here behind me. The project has costed £15 million and local people will be able to enjoy a much more attractive bus hub compared to the one already in use. There have been four months of delays to the project, but final preparations are underway ahead of its opening on Tuesday. But what do local people really think of the new bus station? I think it's a lot more better, yeah. um, bigger, more space. Well, we needed the new bus station, so whatever it's going to cost, it's going to cost, isn't it? It's a lot cleaner, uh, modern, so it's a lot better. It looks more like a train station, I think. If you look at it, it looks like it looks like London Houston. It looks like you know to me, first time I seen it, I thought it was an airport, you know. So mostly positive reviews from local people. I got an exclusive look inside the bus station, however, I wasn't allowed to bring recording equipment inside, so I had to use a stills camera. The new bus station is being seen as the gateway into the city centre. Its unique design has already led to it gaining nicknames such as the whale or the bus wave. It's more eco-friendly, with solar power being involved in its electricity supply. Interactive boards allow passengers to plan their journeys and much more. There are 22 bus bays in total and around 120 buses will be leaving the station every day. Councillors were very impressed with the bus station, calling it a triumph. This is Maddie Andrews reporting for Staffs Live.